Hi kids, welcome back to five new English words every day. I'm Joe, and I'm very excited to learn five new words with you today. Have you ever looked around your house and thought about all the different things you can see? That's our topic for today, household items. And today's five new words are iron, Lamp, switch, kettle, and remote control. The first word is iron. Iron, 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 iron. Oh, it's time for work. I'd better put my shirt on. Let's have a look. <sighs> hmm. I need to iron it. <laughs> da -da. Whoop, ba -da, da -da. And iron is what we use to make our clothes look smooth and smart. There's a handle, a button for adjusting the temperature, but the most important thing is this smooth steel base. That's what's going to make our clothes look really smooth and smart. When you plug it in, the base is going to heat up and help us iron all the creases out of our clothes. But remember, an iron is very heavy and it gets very, very hot. So ask your parents to iron your clothes for you. No, no, you need your parents to help. Okay. Iron! I-R-O-M. Iron. The second word is lamp. 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 I guess every one of you has got a lamp at home. A lamp gives us light. We need a lamp for reading, doing your homework and seeing in the dark. A lamp is really easy to use. You just plug it in and turn the switch. Remember to turn on your lamp when you're reading or doing your homework to protect your eyesight. Lamp. L A M P. Lamp. The third word is switch. Switch, 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 switch. Why is it so dark in here? I can't see anything. Oh, oh, is it? Is that it? <laughs> There's the switch. I found it. This is where the switch is. Switches are often very small and put them on the wall like this. So when you think about it, even though a switch is really small and tiny, it's one of the most frequently used household items there are. Sweet. S W I T C H. Switch.
The fourth word is kettle. 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 So thirsty. Ah. Oh. There's no water. No water in there either. I think we can use a kettle. A kettle boils the water. If we drink the water without boiling it, you're going to get a really bad stomach ache. It's not hard to use a kettle at all. All you need to do is fill it up with water. Close the lid. Put it down on the cooker. Flip the switch to turn it on. And now we just have to wait. Oh, look, it's finished boiling now. I can turn it off. Now I've got some water that's safe to drink. K E T L E. Kettle! K E T T L E. Kettle. The fifth word today is remote control. Remote control. Remote control. Remote. Remote. Control. Control. Remote control. Oh. I'm sure you know what this is for, right? To turn on the TV and watch five new English words every day, you need a remote control. But we don't just have remote controls for TVs. We have them for all sorts of other household items as well. This one's for an air conditioner. This one's for a DVD player. Thanks to remote controls, we can control all sorts of different household items without even getting out of your chair. Awesome, right? Are you on control? R E M O T E. C O N T R O L. Remote control. So I've had a really great time learning five new exciting words with you today. Let's say them all together one more time. Iron. Lamp. Switch, kettle, and remote control. That's all we've got time for today, but I'll see you next time for five new English words every day. Bye bye! Bố mẹ và các bé ơi, hãy like và subscribe YouTube channel VTV7 Kids để có thể học ngoại ngữ với năm từ mới tiếng Anh nhé.